Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Sunny Beauty here and I'm back with another video. I know. I know. Today, guys, I'm gonna be doing a get ready with me. I'm gonna be doing my hair. I'm gonna be doing my makeup. So my hair is a little bit wavy right now. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna get this straightened out and situated because I am having a girls' night. I'm going to my friend's clothing launch, Slave by Ten, and yeah, all of my friends are gonna be there, and we're gonna be taking a bunch of pictures. So I need to make sure I am on point. Also guys, I just want to let you know this video is sponsored by Ana Luisa. It is a jewelry brand and they actually let me pick out a few items from their website and I'm so happy I get to try them out today. So just a little bit about Ana Luisa. They are all about sustainability guys. I didn't know this but I know now that it takes 20 tons of earth mining to produce one gold ring or even cheap jewelry and usually that jewelry is never recycled. But with Ana Luisa guys, they use 100% recycled gold and sterling silver, which is amazing for the earth and the environment guys. And with that being said, very affordable for everybody. Their prices start at $49 and up for such good quality products. Um, their jewelry is actually made by the same jewelers as Tiffany and Co and Louis Vuitton. So you know the quality is on point guys. So yeah, with that being said, they're so confident in the quality that each item has a one year warranty on it. Like, come on. So the jewelry actually doesn't tarnish and it's very long wearing. So that is so amazing. So I'm gonna show you guys a few of the pieces that I got. Um, first thing I wanna mention is that it came in this little nice felt tip bag, which is good because this protects your jewelry actually. So it just has a little button here and everything comes inside. I got three items. I got two rings and a pair of earrings. So I'm gonna show you guys them up close. So this is one of the rings that I got, super cute guys, and it just comes on this little string. On the tags that it comes on, it says like a little saying, so this says beautiful things. The next one that I got is this simple gold ring. So the other gold ring was a little bit uh, thicker. This one's a little bit thinner, super, super cute. And on this one, it says, your jewelry has been handcrafted to last. We wish you many happy times together, so cute. These are the earrings that I got, so nice. I love that they're like small, but they're a little bit chunky. Super cute and super on trend right now. Like this type of stuff is very on trend at the moment. And on the back of this one, it says, they look good attached to me, even better attached to you. So it's such a cute little message. So I'm gonna pop in this jewelry right now and I'm gonna show you guys how it looks on me. So cute. Oh, it's so dainty. It's not like huge and big. Um, usually I wear like gold hoops and they're a little bit bigger and a little bit more of a statement, but these ones are like a, I feel so dainty. <laughs> I feel like my hair should be like tucked back. <laughs> yeah, so I like this. I like these a lot. So I'm, when I'm finished styling and everything like that, I'm gonna put it together with my outfit and yeah. I wanted one of these rings so bad, guys. Like one of these like thicker kind of gold rings. So cute, I love this. And I actually had a ring like this before. Um, that's why I chose this one because this one is longer lasting, like so cute. And I like to layer my rings, like if I have multiple, I like to layer them or put them on separate hands. So I'm gonna put this small one, this is a little small gold one. It's like a little bit thinner. And I'm gonna put that on my other hand. So nice guys, ooh, I love this. So this is the jewelry that I picked out. Honestly, I love these pieces. Like I'm so happy that I picked these ones out because I will be wearing them with everything. Um, another thing I want to mention guys, I do have a coupon code with Ana Luisa. It is Sunny Beauty 10 and you can get 10% off of your order. So yeah, I'll leave all the information for the jewelry down below. Hope you guys enjoy it like I'm enjoying it. I love this. I couldn't wait to do this video for you guys so I can actually like, you know, show you guys and wear it. Um, but yes guys, the prices are very fair, very affordable. I highly recommend them because I pretty much can wear these with everything. It's not overpowering and I also wear like this gold necklace as well. So it doesn't, you know, it doesn't disturb it too much. So I'm happy about that. Shout out to Ana Luisa. Okay, so we're gonna get into the makeup portion guys. Um, did my skincare routine. That's probably why I look a little shiny, which is fine. I'm gonna be using primer and all that stuff right now. Anyway, okay, so guys, I'm starting with my brows already done. I'm just gonna move on to my eyes. Right now, the eye primer that I'm gonna be using today is the e.l.f. Eye Putty Primer. And I'm just gonna use my finger to apply that.
And then for my eyeshadow palettes today, I'm gonna be using two. I'm gonna be using the Juvia Place Zulu palette and then also the e.l.f. Bite Size palette in Truffs, mainly because I want to use like the dark brown and the black in this palette and this palette doesn't have that. First, I'm gonna be going in with this orangey shade and some of the yellow, maybe like just maybe these three all together. Okay, so I just brought you guys a little bit closer, but I'm gonna start with this, uh, these three shades in my crease area. Type of look I'm going for today, I'm kind of going for something a little bit more on the smoky side. So I'm just starting with a warm shade in my crease and then I'm gonna deepen it up with the e.l.f. palette. But I love the Juvia's Place palette. Like I wish, I do have the Warrior 2 palette. I could have used that, but I don't have it with me on hand. So I'm just gonna use this. Okay, so next I'm gonna go in with my e.l.f. Bite Size palette in Truffs. And I'm just gonna use the dark brown shade first. I'm gonna go back into the Zulu palette with this dark brown shade here and just tap some of that with the dark brown from the e.l.f. palette because I want the brown to be a little warm but not too, too smoky, you know? Then I'm gonna go in with the dark brown shade and the black and I'm just focusing that on the very outer corners. And that's just to deepen it up a little bit and I'm just going back in with the fluffy brush that I used originally just to diffuse everything and then going in with the dark brown and the black on the very outer corners okay and then I'm gonna go in with this kind of like rose goldy pinky shade right here from the Zulu palette and I'm just gonna put that on my lid right in this area here it's like a nice pretty gold color it doesn't look like it's gonna be gold, but it's like a rose gold. It's kind of like a duochrome. And I'm bringing it a little bit higher than I usually do. So I just went back in with a little bit of that orange shade and I'm just using that to diffuse out that shade there. Next, I'm gonna be using this liquid glitter from Stila. This is in the shade Golden Girl. And I'm just gonna apply that all over where I put the gold color, just so it can get a little bit, you know, sparkly and glittery. Yeah, I got this in a set like for Christmas, so it's a little tiny one. I'm literally like trying to scrape it out. I feel like I waited too long because it's a little dried out right now. And my outfit is really, really neutral, guys, so I don't wanna like kill it because I really like my outfit so I just want something to kind of complement it I love using my makeup as my accessory it's so quick but so effective because now I'm gonna do liner and lashes and it's gonna tie all together I'm gonna be using my essence liquid liner I love this liquid liner this is the liquid ink so it's supposed to be like 24 hours So I'm gonna be going in with the Maybelline Gel Tattoo Liner. This is in the shade Bold Brown, and I'm just gonna line my lower lash with this. And then on a pencil brush, I'm gonna go back in with the dark brown and some of the black, very little of the black though, um, for my lower lash line. So majority of the brown and like a, like a second, like a little tap of the black. I'm just gonna run that on my lower lash line. So the lashes I'm using today are from RD Beauty in the style Liverpool. I use RD Beauty lashes a lot. I used to use them a lot on my channel and I use them a lot on my clients now because I just love how affordable they are. Okay, so my lashes are on now, which are perfect. I really like my eyes, and I brought my shadow a little bit higher today. Usually I don't bring it this high, but because the lashes and the liner are a little bit, you know, more bold, I want you guys to be able to see the gold. And I'm gonna move on to my face now. So I'm gonna be priming my face today with my e.l.f. Putty Primer. This is the original one. I know they have a few other types, but this is the original. And I love this primer so much. You guys know this already. It just really helps to smooth out my pores and it's 
I don't want to say it's mattifying, but it leaves my skin looking really like smooth and like satiny. Um, they do have a mattifying one, which I'd recommend if you're looking for something mattifying. I do have it, but I kind of like when my skin looks like satin. <laughs> So for my foundation today, I'm going in with the Maybelline Fit Me Matte Poreless Foundation. This is in the shade Warm Coconut, which is 356. The only thing I don't like about this foundation is that I have to pour it on the back of my hand. I love foundations that have a pump on it, so I hope in the future they do have the version where you can pump. I know they have the pouch like that you can squeeze out now, but they don't have that available um, in Canada. So unfortunately, I still have to pour it out on the back of my hand. I'm gonna be going in with my flat top brush to apply that. I love this brush so much. And this foundation is a medium to full coverage mattifying foundation. And I love the finish of it actually. Okay, so for my concealer, I'm gonna be going in with a Born This Way multi-use concealer. I have the shade Butterscotch and I love this concealer, guys. I'm pretty new to using this and I love it so, so, so much already. I'm just gonna blend that out with my Beauty Blender. To set my concealed areas, I'm gonna use my Fenty uh, Pro Filter Setting Powder. This is in the shade Banana. I always use this powder, so. And then to set the rest of my face, I'm gonna be using my MAC Mineralized Skin Finish Powder. This is in the shade Dark, and I'm just gonna be using a fluffy powder brush to apply that. For my contour, I'm going to be using my Brownie Bar Palette from Beauty Bakery. I'm just going to go in with the two, these two shades right here. I like the contrast that it gives. Like It's like a deep, warm color. I don't know. I don't know how to describe it, but I'm just going to tap into these two. More so of the contour shade than the like blushy shade. use the same palette but I'm gonna use a highlighter in this palette because I love this highlighter like it's such a pretty highlighter okay guys so before I do my lips I'm gonna be setting my face with my math fix plus setting spray lip liner I'm gonna be using today is the Shayla X ColourPop lip liner in BFF4 I love this lip liner And then I'm gonna go in with the Morphe Liquid Lipstick in Taunt. And then on top of that, I'm gonna go in with also the Morphe Boho uh, Lip Gloss. Guys, I also have a discount code with Morphe, so if you wanna save some money off of your online order, then the discount code is GLAMFAM667. I'm gonna go in with Boho Lip Gloss. It's like a nice like pinky nude. I love this combo. And I don't know why I always, always, always have to go in with a clear gloss. So I'm just gonna move on to my hair now. It won't take me long because it's already installed and everything, but it's a little bit wavy and I'm gonna get that out. I'm just gonna be using my flat iron to kind of straighten that out really quickly. So it can be nice and sleek. Mm, I'm getting the look already. Okay, so it is nice and sleek now. That was like two seconds. The thing I like about bobs are that literally takes you seconds to get back to, you know, looking good. So I'm gonna be using some of the Got To Be um, gel. This is the black one. And I'm just gonna use a little bit of that just to do my baby hairs. So I'm gonna be using this edges brush and I'm just gonna kinda re-sweep my sweeps. <laughs> re-sweep my edges. Get it a little bit more secure. Okay guys, so this is the finished look. I hope you really enjoy this video. 
Um, I also want to give a big shout out again to Ana Luisa because the jewelry is so dainty, guys. Like, this is going to go so good with my outfit. Go follow me on Instagram at Sunny Beauty if you want to see the full fit, guys. So, yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. Forget to subscribe and turn on your post notification bell button so you know whenever I post a new video. Okay, bye, guys.